All right, guys. I'm making an educational video on uh, fish tanks, and um, so pretty much I got this fish tank yesterday. This is a 10 gallon fish tank. Note that the PS4 is right there, and um, yeah, it's, you know it's pretty big. And uh, I had a five gallon one. I have two platies, red tails, and then uh, sun tails or whatever they're called. <laughs> but I'm mostly making this video about the Amano shrimp. I actually had them in that little small five gallon tank. Not all of them, I only had two of them. And the lady that she sold them to me was uh, came with guppies and I got rid of the guppies. Uh, don't get guppies. I'm letting you know right now, guppies, don't get them. They are very, very hard to maintain. Although it is a beginner fish, they are very hard to maintain. They die out of nowhere. I mean, you're literally like, your guppy will be fine, everything will be fine. And then, the other one decides to pick at it and then done literally dead so and but some people you know uh they say they're beginners but they're not beginners they already made some research and um they already know what they're doing and so basically this is a 10 gallon tank i actually put the water in yesterday um i had some cloudy water but i uh it was that's called new tank syndrome i use the start right uh, it kills chlorine it kills everything and basically it's, it's only three dollars at your local pet co and uh your local pet shop i'm pretty sure they must have them and yeah so i i started off with uh this plant and you can see the amano shrimp right there these are pretty big amano shrimp there are about five of them in the freaking tree it feels like a tree now because uh the way they're they they're they're setting it up there's two of them right there three of them I don't know, I guess they're having sex or <laughs> I don't know what they're doing to tell you the truth. <laughs> but they seem to like each other very a lot and um they don't hurt each other, they're very peaceful. There's a smaller one right there and there's one, two, three, four. There's four of them right here, and the fifth one is somewhere around here. He usually likes to hang out by himself. Oh there he is on that side. I also have a, a ghost shrimp in here that came with the platies. I picked them up today because uh, he fell inside the cage and I was like, ah, whatever, you know, I'll just take them too. And then, so these are the platies. That's a male. And that's the female back there. That's another female. Usually the, the female platies are a little bit bigger than the male platies, but it's vice versa. And uh, I do have a, uh, there's a, a Aquion, Aquion? Aquion uh, um, 10 gallon fish tank and it comes with the Aquion three stage. Actually, I want to say second, two stage or three stage. Um, no, this is two stage. It still uses the filter, the, the, the cartridges. So, you know, it's pretty cool. I mean, the cartridges, you know, make sure you get this. The filter is always the best thing for it. Uh, my light, you know, I bought it for 10 bucks on freaking. I bought this tank yesterday for 10 bucks on offer up that's also a great way if you're barely gonna get into uh barely gonna get into uh tanks i recommend i highly recommend the start right a live plant because it gives great oxygen you can scatter the live plant around you know different places and i do have different well i have that little coral thing that my little girl shrimp likes to go into and uh, yeah this is this this is 10 bucks you know it was pretty rough on the outside but it's just the cover i mean you know you want the inside you want the actual glass to be good as long as it's it's good you're all right you know you're not they're not you're not gonna make a big deal out of it i mean it looks like it is pretty well taken care of there's no leaks whatsoever only there's a little water right here because i had the the net also i have uh two nets i have two nets i have the smaller one. Oh, they're about the same size I am gonna get a bigger one for the shrimp. They're so hard to catch. They are so hard to catch when cleaning this tank. I do 100% water uh, clean. I do clean my tank 100%. That means I take out all the water and I leave it there. And I, I do everything, but I always start with a start right. I always gotta have that. I clean out my tank very, very good and uh, I don't scrub it, I just let whatever's on the side. I mostly just the water change because the water will get bad and it will release a lot of nitrates and ammonias 
these fish don't platys are a really good fish because they don't they don't do a lot of they don't do a lot of ammonia and they're a very good fish i mean honestly they don't care about your hp as much these are beginner fish these are beginner fish the gulpies don't let anybody tell you otherwise they are not beginner fish they are not beginner fish believe me from experience i've killed four guppies already and they are not beginner fish okay so you have to like have a really good planted a good setup yeah so look at all this amount of shrimps inside there they like to hang out they're mostly nocturnal so they'll tr i turn off the light at night the fish don't like it but the amount of shrimp really love it they come outside i also have a snail a snail let me see i have a inca snail this inca snail will eat all the algae and yeah if you don't know what you're doing, start off with a five gallon tank. Get to know the fish. You'll kill a lot of fish, but remember, the pet company or the, the pet, you know, all the stuff, the Petco and all that stuff, they kill more fish than you do. I mean, you know, they they don't care about the fish. I mean, I know it's sad, but they're just fish, guys, you know. I know you want to have them. I know you want to name them. I know you want to do all that stuff. Just relax with it, you know. They're, they're not as... They're not your dog. <laughs> They're not your dog. So, yeah, I would say on that on that part, you gotta just hold on with it. And um, yeah, so it's maybe just a short, short, a medium, short video of what my tank looks like now. I used to, I used to have the other one. And yeah, I bought this on Offer Up. You can get this anywhere. And uh. uh is there more questions maybe i make another video go ahead and comment like my video please and um if there's any questions about like a follow-up you guys can you guys want any more questions or have any more questions about platys i pretty much know a lot about platys um i know there's a lot of varieties i know there's a lot of things there's, there's a lot of platys out there there's a lot of platy fish and you got tons and tons and tons of species now of platy fish. But they're mostly the same thing. You got to make sure that they don't fight. Once you see the, them start fighting, having sex is different. But platys, the, you can tell. We can tell right away. The courtship looks different than what the actual fighting does. And you see, there's not, they're not fighting. They're not fighting. They're chill. They're, everybody's chill in there, you know. They really like each other. Yeah, so this is it. I basically, you know, I'm gonna gonna keep four fish inside there because I won't. I don't over, don't over, don't over. What's it called? Your your tank and the petco should tell you. It says right there. Don't ever go goldfish for a ten gallon tank. Get goldfish if you're gonna have a big, really huge ass pond outside for you can see them grow. Because goldfish inside a little small little tank. No, I would not suggest that. Maybe one goldfish for ten, for ten gallon. Yeah, they release a lot of ammonias, and they release a lot of shit, and they're they're carp, you know, they're a carp. <laughs> they need a big spaces. They get really big. Also, um, don't ever get pleco. They get humongous. Plecos get about two inches long. They get super big. Um, get the shrimp. Get the platys. Don't get plecos. If you want a small catfish, make sure it does not eat your um your shrimp yeah all right guys video's done